Okay, I really don't know where to begin here, but this is our first art vlog of the year. Um, I don't even know what we're doing here. I feel like I've put uh, so many unrealistic expectations on myself when it comes to creating that um, I've kind of convinced myself that I'm not good at what I'm doing. Um, and I know it's a me problem and I feel like I've put these imaginary limitations on myself and I, I kind of just need to work through it. Um, so we're back doing art vlogs and um, before we get into it, uh, I kind of f uh, entered the sunken place um, and I'm really trying to work through it. I really am and I feel like what I've done is uh, dropped all this jewelry that I, I spent three months making all of this jewelry and um i just once it was done i had no energy to promote anything and i feel like it flopped and um i don't know so anyways uh we released a whole line of jewelry and accessories uh, called the whatever line and the goal with that is i kind of want like i don't like just plain jewelry. I like something that's going to be like a statement piece. Um, so that's what my goal was with these necklaces and, and art. Like I want to call them like art pieces because they took so long to make. Um, uh, my goal was just to make jewelry for anyone. Like it's whoever can wear it. I don't care. Like it's, it's gender neutral. Just like if you like it, wear it. Um, made with like the, all this these back here like all of my beads and all of my my things for that it's like just made with whatever I have uh, to be worn with whatever however accessorized with whatever however um, it's almost like a way of me saying like there's no imaginary limitations um, but like through jewelry and um, Today I'm going to be, uh, I was actually commissioned to make a customized whatever necklace um, for someone that my mom works with. Uh, I, I was actually asked to make a necklace, bracelet, and keychain set. So I'm going to uh, walk you guys through what I do when I make something from scratch, like, you guys are going to see my process from start to finish, how I make each of these necklaces. Um, if you'd like to check out the store, there's lots of them left. A couple of them have been purchased. Um, but I'm just excited to put more stuff up there. And uh, I really hope that you guys enjoy. And uh, I will say, for the month of April, we are going to be having all of the four by four paintings that I have uh, that I've done listed for four dollars for the fourth month of the year anyways I just felt like the whole like four theme was fun so four by four paintings four dollars for the month of April uh, so you'll be able to check that out on the website if you are interested in that I also want to add that uh, for the month of April any order at all on our website uh, is going to come with a free piece of art, uh, regardless of how much your order is. Uh, we're just trying to clear out some of the older stock that we have to make room for some new ideas and new things. So um, any piece of art, any jewelry, anything, anything at all uh, ordered on our website, you will get a, uh, a whole thing piece of art extra with it so um in saying that i'm going to get ready to do some crafting here and make some jewelry after i do all of this i did actually record uh painting one of the 4x4 canvases and i recorded doing some diamond painting like the little diamond art um so i'm going to insert all that at the end uh, just because I have it and I feel like I should upload it. 
Um, so let's get started with the uh, Rin is meowing in the kitchen. Okay, I'll be honest with you. Uh, I made little magnets. They're about this big. Okay, put them on the fridge. Rin loves to just play with them all the time. So now like her new favorite toy and activity is messing with the magnets on the fridge. And I guarantee she's mad because I moved all of the magnets so that I wouldn't get interrupted. And she's still yelling at me. So first, before I start, I'm going to just kind of insert uh, an example of what I'm going to do. Um, what I've been asked is to make a necklace that has the name Yasmin in the middle and all pink. So I'm going to look through my pink or look through all of my clay charms. I'm going to pick out some pink clay charms. And usually for the whatever necklaces, I go for between uh, I go for between 14 and 16 uh, charms because I do add seed beads to every single one of them, and uh, we'll go from there. So we'll start with the pink whatever necklace, and then also for the bracelet. I don't know how well you can see it, but I've got. Um, flower beads and that's gonna be the vibe for the bracelet and then I have all of my little resin I have all my little resin things here for keychains so I'm going to build a pink keychain set so um, I'm gonna flip the camera down and then we're gonna get started making some jewelry from scratch
All right, this looks like an absolute mess right now, but I promise it has a purpose. Um, okay, so finished with the necklace bracelet keychain. I wanted to make some sort of packaging for it, so I had some leftover cardstock. Uh, I just folded it, cut it out into this, uh, used a stamp that Scott sent over uh, on the stamp pad, and uh, created my own packaging here. So, what I will do is, bracelet goes on. And then we have easy packaging. For the necklace, I will fold it in half just so it doesn't get ruined and kind of let the name dangle on there. And then we have an all pink keychain, a very girly all pink keychain. All right, so there is that. I will tend to the mess afterwards. Uh, so, uh, here is just a plain white bag. I'm just going to stamp it with the little butterfly stamp a couple of times, just for a little touch. Okay, on some scrap glitter paper, I'm just going to write a thank you note. That can go in the bag. And then to tie the whole theme in, I'm going to add some holographic butterfly stickers. And that's all she wrote. So I'm going to throw it back to past Ashley and we're gonna see some painting and some diamond art. And after that, uh, it'll be the end of the vlog. So I will see you guys very soon, hopefully for another art vlog. Uh, don't forget to check out our website uh, for some jewelry, some artwork, $4 paintings. You can use code De De deadgirl10 for 10% off your order. Uh, yeah. Thank you for watching. Enjoy. All right. No. <laughs> um, I have wanted to try diamond painting for a while. Uh, this I found at Dollar Tree today and it was only like a buck fifty. It comes with everything in here, a little cacti. So I figured this might be fun to try. Uh, I'm hoping that this is not going to give me anxiety. These pieces are so small. Oh my god. Okay. Um, okay. Okay. Everything is laid out. I am going to just time lapse this uh, and... I'm sure I've already talked about this by now, but oh my god, these pieces are so tiny. Okay, anyways, I'm gonna, we're gonna speed this up and I'm gonna try and make a little, a little cactus. Oh. Oh. Okay. So, what I'm gathering is this is 
sticky. This part is sticky. So I am to stick those on there and then stick this onto this and then do the whole keychain bit. Okay. I'm gonna figure this out.